Hey guys, last of us here, and today we're gonna talk about all the Lego Batman movie 2017 sets. Uh, I'm not good to say this, but yeah, we're gonna take them in the biggest first. So, the first set we're gonna talk about is uh, Arkham Asylum, the new Arkham Asylum, and this is the biggest set. I think it's pretty awesome, uh, mostly because of the minifigures. There are some f things I really don't like so much about it is I don't really like the brown color but uh, that's probably just me I don't uh, am a biggest fan of the brown color scheme I would love if, if it was uh, dark red because that's one of my favorite colors uh, in the time right now but uh, that wouldn't really be so accurate to the movies and all that stuff but I just would have loved to gray or dark red that could have been so great color for me but that's just nitpicking. Um, I actually really like the set. I think that's a lot of really great minifigures in it. Some, especially, uh, what is my favorite figure? I think all of these figures are gonna come in other sets because they all have these orange shoots on uh, suits on. And I don't really like that so much, but I think it's it's fine for what it is. You can put them on other bodies, but I won't be getting the set, I will won't, I don't have a place to work on the silent, and I just won't be getting the set, uh, that's nothing really so much interesting about it, but I can see the appeal to it and all that stuff, I can see why people want to buy it, it's, it's definitely a great set, but I won't be buying it myself personally, but that's just my opinion, uh, but yeah, it's a great set, I don't know how much it cuts, it's, I think it's up in the $100, if it's less, I just think it's, that's awesome, but you get a lot of mini figures in it, and um, that's just that. The Bat Cave. I actually like this set more for some odd reasons. I know some people will really hate it because it's not that great of a build, but I just it's just appeal more to me. I just like a build. I really like the duck because I just love ducks, and uh, I don't really like the bat boat speeder thing. That's not. So interesting to me, but uh, what I really like is just the Pinkman and his three Pinkmans and Blue Swain with that new butterfly piece that looks fantastic. You get a new three exclusive bats uh, dresses that look really awesome. I really like the the I cannot say the name of it. I'm not uh, I'm not that good to these names, but I still really love the set, especially the three bat suits, and I can't see. I can see some people will like them set like me because I will like it. That's it's not my favorite, but I will be getting that's probably I'm probably gonna get this set just because I actually will like it. Um so yeah. I already have talked about this set, but just gonna do it again because uh, why not? It's a pretty awesome set. I, I won't be giving them, giving this set anyway because I First off, I was only going to get this set because of the Robin minifigure, but I know that's a uh, Lego Dimension story pack. You can be getting the Robin figure and the Batgirl figure. I think, I, I know actually, I'm going to talk about that uh, level pack in the end of the video. So, nothing really interests me about this anymore. It's, it's an awesome build. I really like the design and all that stuff. It's just, I already have a really fantastic bat bad car um so yeah that's nothing really more to it uh, but uh Robin is definitely a very awesome figure so th that's it's that i'm also still very hyped for this set i love the gold and the purple color of the car i think it's the best set to get mini figures i I, I, this is probably my three favorite mini features of the whole line. I think Joker is fantastic with the arm printing and new hair piece. I think Harley Quinn is also really fantastic with the arm printing and hair piece. And Batgirl is also fantastic with the purple and arm printing and all that stuff. It's such a fan it's three fantastic features. Three, be three best features of the line. The car is okay to me. I do not think it's the best build. Ever, but uh, I still think it's a pretty awesome car for what it is. It got some great small details, like it can do stuff like a car can, and it can jump up and down and do like a party thing. And my little brother, my little brother, and I pro definitely gonna get this set because he loves the car and I love the mini features. And 
that's just a good deal for us but it's not the set I'm most hyped for but it's still a 7 out of 10 set I don't know why but this is the set I'm most hyped for it's the Mr. Freeze mech set I love this set probably because it's so cheap it's the cheapest of them so uh, I can get it so easily I can make a review on it so easily and I really need a Mr. Frost figure Really, I have ruined the Batman Batcave um, minifigure. It's not the Batcave, the promo promotion Bat Mr. Freeze figure. I have really ruined it. I have lost some of the pieces. So I really, I really need this Mr. Freeze figure. I'm so happy. It's just such a fantastic Mr. Freeze figure. It's probably the only reason why I'm gonna get this set. It's because of my Mr. Freeze figure. I will really love it. Set like this. It's not a Nexonite torso. It's older than that. It's an old like torso piece, like a body armor piece. He got this glass on the head. I don't know how they have done that, but we're gonna see. And also, just like the manga, it's an interesting build, especially to me. Um, and I think the hands pieces on the manga is actually new. They have like these joints on, so that's pretty awesome. Also, really like the gun. And I just think you get free features. A cheap set, really cheap. I'm gonna get it so easily because it's so cheap. It's only I think 40 bucks. And that's really cheap. So, and I just love when I can get a set so easily. Um, fantastic. It's like I think it's the same process. I, I think it's cheaper when way speeders way way speeder sets way speeder set. But yeah, that's pretty much all I have to say about it. I'm just excited for it because it's so cheap. We also gonna be talking about the Lego Dimension stuff, and this is the story pack. It's pretty awesome. I like it. It's like a bad computer, and I know you get like six level of it, and that's gonna be in the movies. So it's pretty awesome. I love that. That's a great idea. I think the bad girl. I'm not sure about it, but I think the bad girl figure you have some exclu exclusive printing on the torso. I'm not sure about it. Uh, and I think um, the Robin figure has some exclusive printing on the eyes, but uh, say if I'm wrong, uh, I'm pretty sure about it, but I'm probably also wrong. And I love the new printed pieces for the like back computer on it, and it look like a bat. It's pretty awesome, but I'm mostly hyped for it because of the figure, and I'm not hyped for it because it's a story pack, because I can make my Lego Dimension work, I can download the new thing to my Lego Dimension so I can't play Lego Dimension year 2 I can only play year 1 but uh, that's fine um, I know that some many people that had that problems, uh, problem I know just to go to have some problem with his Wii U but um, I have an Xbox 360 my problem is just I can't put it on the web so I can't really get any Wi-Fi so I can download the new Adds to uh, the year two, so I can't get the year two because of that. And I, I don't have any Wi-Fi in my house, and that's a problem we have had in two years. So the way I make videos is actually because of 4G, if you know what that is, um, stuff. So yeah, that's my secret. And Bluetooth, I use Bluetooth to my computer. So yeah, and I also have internet in school. I just want to let you know, no question in the comments. How I make videos without Wi-Fi, I just don't have a Wi-Fi in the house. But yeah, I, I have Wi-Fi, I think, to the TV. That's something special. It's a, it's a complicated thing in my house. But uh, yeah, let's get to the last thing. And the last thing is a Lego Dimension, like, fun pack of the... I'm, I'm not sure about the name of him, and I can't see it's so small. But uh, I'm just gonna call him Iron Batman. He's pretty awesome. He's uh, he's look really good. I think he's exclusive to this pack, but uh, yeah, I, I actually pretty sure. But maybe he's not. But he's definitely a really awesome figure, in my opinion. He got some great painting. Has has that piece on the shoulders, and he has a new printed next night sword. Because uh, it's not new printed. It's just without the. Orange printed, so if you like next night, you can have like a turn on sword and a turn off sword. And I know there are also are a blue sword, and we have like three swords. I I think, and that's pretty awesome. I think that's pretty awesome. Great idea, three next swords. 
So yeah, nothing really much to say about this figure. There's also a horse that I know can transform him into a bad copter if you want to transform. But that's pretty much all I have to say about it. So yeah, that's all the um, Lego Batman movie set that's come out so far. I really hope you enjoyed it. Sorry if I didn't talk so fast in the videos. Talking. Sorry if my voice was pretty loud. Sorry if I sounded pretty tired because I was really tired to school and day. I have just looked down a book the whole day and that makes you. That makes me pretty tired. So sorry if I'm sounded very tired, but that, that's because of school and stuff. So yeah, I really hope you enjoyed this video and hope I show you some pictures you didn't know and show you some sets you didn't. No, and got you excited for the new Batman line. That's what I hope for, and I really hope you enjoyed this video. I'll see you again next time, guys. Bye.